My name is Johan Molund. I'm a dentist. I'm running my own clinic here in Vällingby, Stockholm for the last 22 years. I have been a dentist for 26 years. I have been using the Physic Forceps for at least 10 years, almost uh, since they started coming out. Uh, when you take out the tooth, it's uh, important that you create mobility in the tooth first. I usually start with a luxator to just get to know the tooth, feel around and see how tough the tooth is gonna be. Uh, if I don't get any mobility in the tooth, I then go to the physic forceps. I apply the beak on the lingual or the palatal side of the tooth, one to three millimeter subgingivally. The bumper I place as high up in the vestibulum as possible. It's very important that you don't apply large force. You simply apply as much force for the instrument to keep in place and then you rotate the tooth out of the socket. You Sometimes you have to apply the force for a much longer time than you think. One minute, maybe two minutes. And then all of a sudden you feel the tooth like popping. It starts moving. And that's all you need. It's uh, very important that you get to know the instrument and learn how to use it. You want to take out the tooth as atraumatic as possible. And that's when the physic forceps is very useful.